Oh, boy. I feel like pitching cards right now. Hold on. Are you serious? All right. So the whole punch actually means something. Maybe card tricks some other time when I'm not so busy. Manny, what are you doing? Just marking cards, honey. What was the point of that, though? balloons my kid uh, you have any well what is the card gonna fucking do though my kid do you have any See, I saw he had like the card that he had in the machine. But how the fuck am I gonna put the card in the machine? Fucking useful for. Oh, let's break this fucking thing again. Card has to come into play when that guy's in there. I don't get how you would know you need the hole punch you? though, because when he like, pulls out that little card, I don't remember seeing any holes in it.
So I need to blow the fucking switch. Wait, what? Hold on. So where I'm fucking up this card there. I could is apparently when I he's in this get, put the fucking card away. When he's in the room, I'm supposed to like unlock the door or something. I don't fucking know. Like, I turned the, the hand on the door, which I could have sworn I clicked on the goddamn door. But maybe I did it when I had shit in my hand. Do you have any card is going to come into play, but I don't know why. Maybe you figure out you need holes in it if you try to use it as a full card. But I don't fucking know. But there's a latch on the door I'm supposed to click before I leave the room. Hopefully this is the last time I have to do this bullshit. Share like an actual um, inventory like, screen. You need to like scroll through the shit each time. down again what else is new all right click on the fucking door this game is very puzzly hey no still I'm... wow that's I all i had a an open door fucking Strange, dear. yet symbolically compelling unbelievable Go through the door. Good enough for government work. I can't believe it was that easy and simple. Time reading stories to dying children. That's good. 
That's really good. I think you're it, Mercedes Colomar. I think you're the one for me. Cool. Gladys, are you loco? What got into you? Jesus. It was a company car. Oh, yeah. And it's even better company now. I'm in. Eat it, Domino. Buenos dias. You're not the nurse? Ooh, sup? No. You're not here to give me my medication? No, but I am here to ease your pain. Guess they couldn't save me, huh? Pain no, and suffering. But there's still a chance you could save me. That's a lot of responsibility, Mr. Calavera. What makes you think I've been all that good? Miss Colomar. Meche, please. Meche. I can see it in your face and in your file here, where it says you're entitled to a first-class ticket to... Nowhere? What? Did I do something wrong? Not according to your bio. It was spotless. At least the part I read was. I'm not sure I like the implication, Mr. Calavera. The only implication here is that I'm fired. Are you sure you're Mercedes Calamar? Anything about your past you haven't told me? Quite a bit, considering I've told you nothing. Mean to animals? Oh no, I love animals. Once, when I was volunteering at an animal shelter, I... Just stop right there. I've never paid taxes in my life. Aha. Uh -huh. I've never made enough money to be taxed. You know, it's mostly been all volunteer work. Uh-huh. Did you kill much when you were alive? Very little. Never killed anybody? I have to confess, I never killed anybody. Not even a teensy bit of killing? Maybe I just wasn't trying hard enough. Hmm. Ever cheated on your husband? Mr. Calavera, there's no ring on my finger. There's no skin on it either. I guess you'll just have to trust me then. Hmm. Did you let her? I don't know what she said. Were you a big shoplifter? Well, they accused me of it once. Really? But it wasn't my fault. That puppy followed me out of the store. Oh. Work with me, Meche. Give me some dirt. Well, I could do something bad right now if that would help. Oh. Wouldn't count. Sorry, I give up. Don't say that, Manny. Are you sure you're Mercedes Colomar? Yes. Would you like to see my birthmark? Sure. Where is it? It's wherever you guys put my skin. Excuse me, but I have to go straighten this mess out. Sorry to be so much trouble, Mr. Calavera. It's no trouble, but please, call me Manny. I'm still on the case, Michi, but I haven't found anything for you yet. Maybe I'm not the woman you were hoping for. Oh, I hope you are. I'm sorry I let you down, Manny. Uh, I'm assuming we're going to talk to our boss. Hey, funny bones! In my office! Now! You vandalized company property in order to obtain secret information so you could take your illegally modified company car and your unregistered driver and run Domino here off the road! All in order to steal a client from her legitimate agent! There's nothing legitimate about this place. You give all the good clients to Domino. Manny, now I'm embarrassed for you. You've embarrassed the whole office. I'm going to call the woman in here so you can apologize to her yourself. Ava, send in Ms. Colomar, please. She left about 15 minutes ago, sir. She said she had a long walk ahead of her and she wanted to get started. Walking? She had a ticket on the number nine. Why does she think she has to walk? That's the best package I could find. <laughs> now you see why I give all the good clients to Domino. That woman was a saint and a shoe in for a double end ticket that she's not going to get because you just couldn't find it. And now, because of your little stunt, she's out there on her own, walking by herself through the petrified forest, facing the demons of the underworld alone and unprotected. This is her reward after a lifetime of hardship and public service. Her destiny stolen by some overreaching salesman looking for a fat commission he didn't deserve. 
Get in there and stay put until the boys downtown tell us what they want done with you. Someone's gonna take the fall for this, Calavera, and it ain't gonna be me! He threw us in the fucking little hut. Ooh, ick. It came out like soft serve ice cream, but judging by the smell, I think it's auto body filler. Alright. Doesn't open. Hey, is anybody out there? So, Manuel, have you thought about what you have done? Um. The only way out, Manuel, is to be taken back in. If you are truly still loyal to this company, declare it loudly. The management might hear and stick you right back in their fold. Who the fuck is that? You would do that? That could cause this agency to be crooked. I'm gonna blow the lid off this place. Young man, you are an enemy of the Department of Death. Welcome to the club. Hey, Salvador answered Limones, correctly. Guest. Where are you taking me? To the headquarters of the LSA. LSA? The Lost Souls Alliance. We're a small group, Manuel. We're always looking for new soldiers. To do what exactly? We need help in our intelligence unit. You know Eva, of course. Manny? I was once a Reaper like yourself, Manuel. But I uncovered a web of corruption in our beloved Department of Death. I have reason to believe that the Bureau of Acquisitions is cheating the very souls it was chartered to serve. I think someone robbing these poor, naive souls of their rightful destinies, leaving them no option but to march on a treacherous trail of tears, unprotected and alone, like babies, Manuel, like babies. What's your evidence? That's where you come in, Manuel. Or should I call you Agent Calavera? Manny suits me fine. I'm not looking to join any military organization, Sal. I just want my job back so I can work off my time and get out of this dump. Well... You won't even be able to get out of this city without my help. Which means, of course, you won't be able to find that woman and you'll never get your job back. When you're ready to join the cause, Manuel, come talk to me. We might be of some use to each other. So Ava's a part of this crew, huh? So you're not really a secretary. I'm a spy, Manny. Well, that's the last time we use that temp agency. Any messages for me? <laughs> yes. Join or die. But I'm already... Again! Eva, you gotta get me out of town. They're gonna sprout me. You can't leave, Manny. We need access to the DOD computer network if we're ever gonna find out what's going on. And we can't access without a salesman like you. The computer IDs you when you log on. How does it do that? Fingerprints? I don't have any. Your teeth, Manny. Haven't you ever noticed your computer scanning your teeth when you log on? I thought that was just a power search. We need your teeth, Manny. We can't let you go. Sorry. Doesn't Kapal wonder where you are? Don and Domino are both locked up in Don's office with some bigwig from downtown. Some fatty in a fez. Hmm. Who is the fat man, I wonder? And how does he fit into this sinister puzzle? He's had to stick his head in so he can speak. How long have you been a spy? Salvador recruited me about a year ago. I couldn't resist him. He's just so noble. What are you working on there? I'm trying to get this radio working so we can use it in the field. But it looks pretty hopeless. Salvador's right. We need good old-fashioned homing pigeons to communicate with our field agents. You have field agents? No, it's just Sal and me right now. But someday, Manny. So, you won't help me out of here? Sorry. I'll help you out, but not your teeth. Think it over. That's cool. Have you ever wondered why your clients, even your best clients, never seem to qualify for the packages you know they deserve? Yes. My last client in particular, Mechi. Well, they all did qualify, Manuel. Especially her. But somehow, somebody with access to the files has stolen their just rewards. Their sweet hereafters. Fuck you, Domino. Precisamente. He's giving them to the shitty people. 
What would they do with the tickets? A ticket on the number nine is like a leaf of gold, Manuel. Especially to one who has died with a less than perfect record. Someone is profiting here from those that would buy their way into heaven. But money's not important here. We all just want out. You want to get out, Manuel. And so do I someday. But for some people, this world is all there is. They have decided to seek pleasure and happiness here in the Eighth Underworld. And for that, you need money. What do you want from me? I'm going to build an underground army of souls to fight the injustice I have seen in El Marro. Communication will become vital as the Lost Souls Alliance spreads out. We'll need messengers we can trust. You want me to be your messenger? No, Manuel. Our numbers are small and our agents are too valuable to risk that sort of work. History shows only one messenger to be of use to a cause like ours. Carry your pigeons. Fucking pigeons. If I grab some pigeons off the roof, will you let me go? No. I need to raise them from birth, Agent Calavera. Oh my God. I need you to bring me their eggs. You're keeping me here because you need the eggs? Why are you still here, Calavera? Go get me an Air Force before it hatches. Now that's all the briefing you need, soldier. Viva la revolución! All right. It won't budge. It opens for members of the LSA only. That's cool. Need to get some fucking birds. What can I do in here? Well, that was a weird jump. Hey, what did they do with Gladys? Ooh, ick. It came out like soft serve ice cream, but judging by the smell, I think it's auto body filler. All right. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Let's see, go to the roof. Oops, wrong way. Get some fucking birds. I mean, not the birds, but their eggs. But how do dead birds leave eggs? Hmm. Tom's up. Right, this office is empty. No, you. How am I gonna get over there? Still think I'm locked up, hopefully. So I can't go in there. Um, it's gotta be a way to get to the roof. back up. Maybe it's something about Dom's office, because I can't get in from out, or inside. Maybe I can get through the window. It's it's locked. Okay, maybe. Perfect. All 
Um, what are you looking at? Oh, something's gonna fall down. Ugh, Domino had this in his mouth. Gross. He's got a lock on it. I can't believe he... I'm gonna try to guess his password. Um, bitch. Nope. It's not Golden Boy. Is it password? What the? What's in here? It looks like a glowing hunk of coral. Looks like an anchor. Even the view out of his window is better than mine. Oh, you know what? I can probably use this on the rope because it's got weight on it. Perfect. I wonder if that's how Domino meant it to be used. Um, there we go. No, don't go down. Got skills. There's a lot of pigeons there. that aren't nailed to the roof. Wait, what? Um... Maybe that will scare them. Eventually. So you want to scare them. So I use that, and then I use bread to get them over here. Joy birds, enjoy. It could probably be any balloon if I could think about it. little ledge peckers ledge pecker you must come with me young ones for I am the green reaper I'm still confused on um man are those pigeons gonna be ticked how dead pigeons lay eggs Oh, they said something about needing my oh, god damn it about needing my teeth. 
And we have the mouthpiece. The mouthpiece does a, um... Probably indentation of teeth. And he said that, um... Auto filler was kind of like... Thick. Near our teeth access files. Fill a dent. Good for dents, great for dentures. Chomp chomp. Delicious. Wow, that made a perfect impression of my teeth. Quite a chalky aftertaste, too. What are you doing, bro? I gotta say, these camera angles could be better. Agent Calavera and two guests. Check these babies out. Excellent, Manuel. With these, I can breed an entire army of winged messengers. Our revolution can spread now across the land, carried on the shimmering wings of justice, thanks to you, Agent Calavera. I myself would also like to spread across the land. But you can't. We need your dental work here to access the computer. I am sorry, but freedom has its price. Freedom! Look, you got the eggs you wanted. Now can I go? Sorry, but your teeth. You want my fucking teeth, bro? I got it right here. Boom. I'm not sure what to make of that. Why don't you show it to my intelligence officer? Manny, this looks like a perfect impression of your teeth. We can use this as a mold to make a fake set of teeth and get into the computer system that way. Good work, soldier. You are a friend of the revolution, Agent Calavera. And now... Viva la revolution. Let me la revolution. You must go to Say the town of that Ubatava, time. my friend. Not like a moron. want to find your lost soul. How do you know where she is? I don't. But everyone who wants to get to the Ninth Underworld must cross the Sea of Lament. And therefore must go to Rubacaba to get passage on a ship. As long as you get there before she does, you'll find her. But it may be quite a wait. I'll wait as long as it takes. Manuel, are you in love with her? Love? Love is for the living, Sal. I'm only after her for one reason. She's my ticket out of here. That was some tunnel. I'm all the way to the edge of the petrified forest. Oh. Hey, buddy. Claude is my friend. Why are you crying? Manny? Oh, Manny! They fired me! <laughs> me too, buddy. You don't understand, Manny. I was created just to do that job. It's the only thing that makes me happy. It's like they reached into my chest and pulled out my heart and threw it into the woods to... Gladys, uh. <laughs> what have you done? He just killed himself. Oh, Gladys. Disgusting. Hey, they're... Fucking spiders with goddamn wings. What the fuck? I'm assuming we're supposed to get his hat back. Did I say hat? I meant heart. 
Apparently it's not dead either, he's sleeping. Wake up, buddy. Oh, let's go get his heart. <laughs> 